many of us own pets. And for the typical family or single person, they range from dogs and cats, birds, hamsters, and for some lizards. Pets can be amazing parts of the family, providing love, comfort, and laughs every day. However, some people have a taste for the exotic and costly, desiring pets that are harder to obtain yet fall within legal grounds. In certain states and countries, of course. From the creature who inspired a multi-million dollar video game franchise, the largest rodent in the world, here are 10 exotic animals you can legally own. Number 10. The Kinkajou. Native to the rainforest of Central and South America, the kinkajou is an adorable little tyke that resembles a monkey in certain ways, but is actually closer to raccoons for its family. They can be a perfect pet for anyone who wants a sociable, loving pet. And while they don't seem to be banned anywhere in particular, you will need a special permit to house one. Kinkajous are a bit more high maintenance than some of our future entries, requiring a large, dedicated enclosure that should be filled with branches and ledges for them to jump and hang on. Wooden ladders and rope swings are also loved by the energetic little creature, and it's suggested you spay or neuter your kinkajou in order to prevent hormonal-related issues that can lead to disease as well as trimming their very sharp nails regularly. A kinkajou will cost you anywhere in the area of $1,500 to $3,000 and can live up to 23 years of taken care of properly. Number 9. The Hyacinth Macaw Sporting a brilliant blue coloration over its feathers and a cool yellow circle around its eyes, the hyacinth macaw is a bird you can not only admire but also own for yourself. This bird is native to Central and Eastern South America and is listed as a vulnerable species on the IUCN list. Despite its status, you are well within your legal rights to own one of these beautiful birds in most states, provided you obtained it legally. You will need proper documentation to prove that you got your pet legally, or else you could face heavy fines and jail time. However, purchasing the macaw can be just as costly as the fines, as they cost upwards of $10,000. It is also heavily encouraged to start their training young, as if they don't have the proper discipline, they can end up becoming unruly and possibly hurting you or someone with their talons and very powerful and very sharp beak. Number 8. The Chinchilla. Looking more like an offshoot of the common bunny rabbit, the chinchilla is an adorable addition to anyone's home. Native to the Andes in South America, the chinchilla you're able to get as a pet today are actually descendants of the short-tailed chinchilla, which was sadly hunted to extinction. Modern domestic chinchillas have thinner bodies as well as longer tails and larger ears. While this cute little rodent is a very popular pet amongst exotic owners, they can be a lot of work. Chinchillas require constant dental care, as like with rats, their teeth will continually grow throughout their life, requiring them to constantly gnaw. Despite the care needed to maintain its health, the chinchilla is a very worthwhile pet as long as they have a temperature-controlled room and a good space to run around and play. Chinchillas are legal to own in most states as long as it was not caught in the wild and obtained legally at a price ranging from $150 to $350. Number 7. The Bearded Dragon Coming from Australia, the bearded dragon is actually one of the more common exotic pets among pet enthusiasts. While they may be less exotic, it does not make them any less cool as a pet. The bearded dragon has a lifespan of 10 to 12 years and prefers a solitary lifestyle, otherwise same genders would fight. Adults can reach a length of 24 inches and have a diet consisting mainly of insects. Bearded dragons are calm animals, making them very good pets for children. Just make sure the kids wash their hands after playing with them. The lizard can still get pretty gross. Bearded dragons are legal to own in most states and have a general cost of 250 to 400 bucks. Number 6. The Hedgehog. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna be totally honest here. This entry is for my girlfriend who's absolutely crazy for the cute little pink cushions. But that doesn't make the hedgehog any less cool or cute. Not only was it the inspiration for the very popular and sometimes really, really weird Sonic the Hedgehog franchise, this little rodent is a very popular pet amongst the US population. In fact, this little robot-fighting rodent is only banned in Pennsylvania, Hawaii, California, Georgia, and Maine. Arizona did used to be on that list, but as of January 9, 2020, they're also legal in the desert state. Hedgehogs themselves can be rather easy to care for, not requiring much else to function than the common hamster or guinea pig, only really requiring you to cut their nails for them. Watch out though, they do have quicks like dogs, so don't cut too much. Hedgehogs can be a bit of a gamble, however, as due to overbreeding, they are at risk of a disease called Wobbly Hedgehog Syndrome. WHS is a disease that slowly diminishes the rodent's muscle control, resulting in the hog expiring in less than a year of getting the disease. 
If you are prepared for that risk, however, a hedgehog is a great little pet. Living up to 10 years in captivity and costing you anywhere between $125 to $600 depending on where you go. Hope you're happy, Dita. That entry was for you. Number 5. The Chimpanzee. Okay, yeah, you see this thing right here? You see this monkey? This right here is one of the more difficult pets to have as an exotic pet owner, not just because of state regulations, but, well, you'll see. Now, chimpanzees can be cute and they can make great pets, even having several movies with them as the stars in the 90s for some strange reason, that was a weird craze. Chimps are also one of the hardest to own in the US, being banned from ownership in most states. However, if you are able to obtain a special license, then you may be able to own one in Oklahoma, Pennsylvania, Rhode Island, or North Dakota. Chimpanzees themselves are also a very long-lived pet, living up to 50 years in some cases, so a long-term commitment will need to be made if you want one. Now, here comes the risky part. As I said before, chimps can be great pets, but they also still have a lot of their wild nature in them. This can make them very violent and unpredictable, and while that's concerning in any animal, it's especially terrifying in this primate, as they may only weigh about 150 pounds, but they are easily twice as strong as a human. Oh, and also, chimps can cost upwards of $60,000. Number 4. Fennec Foxes Fennec foxes are just some of the cutest animals in the world, and also happen to be the smallest fox in the entire world. They're sort of a mix of cats and dogs, taking both appearance and behavior traits from both species. Those traits being that they're high energy and love to play like a common dog, but also have a lot of independence much like a cat. Fennec foxes sometimes require a special permit to own, but they're perfectly legal to own in most states, barring Missouri, Minnesota, and Washington. Fennec foxes are very popular pets amongst exotic enthusiasts, but they can also be quite costly, typically being in the range of $2,000 to $3,500 and living up to 14 years in captivity. Be warned, though, that high energy is no joke. You'll be playing with it constantly. Number 3. The Wallaby Looking like a kangaroo, but it's not actually a kangaroo, the wallaby is a cute mini version of the larger and buffer roos. Native to Australia, they may only grow to about 40 inches, but they're just as active and love to jump just as much as the aforementioned roo, so they require a large outdoor space to exercise and play around in. On top of all that, while it doesn't seem any particular state has banned the owning of wallabies, it is illegal to have a wallaby inside certain city limits. Wallabies also generally require you to have a special permit to own one, and wallabies cost anywhere from $1,000 to $4,000 and have a lifespan of up to 14 years. Now it's time for the day's best pick. Today's pick is this innocent-looking monkey. But little do you know that they really are actually pretty innocent. Find out next with number two, the squirrel monkey. Okay, squirrel monkeys are super friggin' cute, living primarily in the forests of Central and South America. They're a high-energy pet, requiring a lot of attention and playtime, but thankfully seem to be a good fit for a small house or apartment. Weighing in at a measly two pounds, this little primate is a much safer alternative than the aforementioned chimpanzee. However, you will still be heavily at risk of having doo-doo thrown at you. While I couldn't find much in terms of their legality in the States, it does seem you need a special permit if you're to own one, and they cost anywhere between $4,000 to $8,000. But that price should be worth it for a monkey sidekick who can live up to 20 years in captivity. Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Number 1. The Capybara Really, who else could end this list? The Capybara is the largest rodent in the entire friggin' world. Weighing in at a hefty 140 pounds, this fuzzy friend is available to own primarily in Texas and Pennsylvania and require you to have, what else, a special license. A Capybara's natural habitat is semi-aquatic, so having a little pool or stone pond is a good suggestion if you want one as a pet. Another suggestion would also be to have a pair of capybaras, or perhaps get a dog use of them as these rodents are highly social animals and don't do well in solitude. Capybaras can be challenging pets, but it is manageable, and they will be with you for up to 10 years. They're also reasonably priced at only about $1,000 to $3,000. And that is our video for today, folks. Tell me, what did you think of these choices? Have you owned any of these cool creatures? If so, why not let us know in the comments below? We'd love to hear your experiences with them. And while you're at it, check out the video shown above. 
With all that said and done, that's our video for today, and I'll see you all next time. Later, everybody.